Hi, I'm, I'm Dr. Jamie Ray. I am the professor assigned to teach uh, History 387, Aspects of the Holocaust, here at the University of Michigan Dearborn. Uh, the class was originally developed by Dr. Sidney Bolkowski, who's passed away now, and I've kind of inherited for that from him. Um, why should students take a course on the history of the Holocaust? In many ways, it seems like it's very simple. Um, Hitler comes to power, decides to round up and begin murdering all the Jews in Europe, and that's what happens. Students who take the course, however, are always surprised to find out that there's so much more involved than that. Uh, almost every sector of German society at the time was involved in one way or another in the Holocaust. Um, the decision wasn't just something that was made overnight. It was really more of a process, and that's how we teach it in this course. And um, really, for other majors, business majors, engineering majors, psychology majors, um, sociology majors, econ majors, it's, it, this course touches on every aspect of, uh, or a lot of different aspects of all these things. So I, when I have engineering majors, we talk about the work that it went in that went into designing and building things like gas chambers and crematoria that were able to, you know, at some point. Uh, murder and cremate 3,000 people per day and that doesn't you know soldiers don't build that police don't build that engineers build that design it economic there's a definite economic aspect to the Holocaust uh, sociological religious racial so the course covers a lot of different things um, I don't want to say that I enjoy teaching a course on the Holocaust because I'd rather not have to teach a course like that because that would mean it didn't happen um, but the thing that I guess I do enjoy about teaching is that it covers all these different aspects and it engages students from all different backgrounds about uh, the event and how it came about.